Welcome to summer and hear that catchy summer beat. Hey internet, Colorful Artie's back for more Harvest Moon 64. Tomorrow a typhoon will hit from the south. Be sure to lock up tight and bring animals inside. Nope, I don't want that. I'm resetting that. Let's try that again. Welcome to summer. There we go. How's everybody doing? Tomorrow's forecast. It'll be fair and clear all day and a little hot. So, okay. Typhoons are really, really bad. If typhoons occur, you cannot leave your house that day. Like, you're literally trapped and you have to just sleep immediately because you physically can't leave your house. Which means you can't feed your chickens and it also means the crops you plant can get destroyed. So, yeah. I would recommend avoiding typhoons at all costs. Oh yeah, summer beat. The chest of drawers has arrived. Special price, 2000G, Rick's shop. That's the new thing Rick has at his store. It's basically a cabinet that lets you store non-perishable items, such as flowers in it. It's kind of good. Also notice how everything's a bit greener in summer. Yes. Morning, chickens. Oh, that's right. I just bought the huge amount of chicken feed, so I will be set for a long time. Yeah, today is the firework festival. However, it doesn't actually start until after dark. One for Ellie, one for the goddess. Rick doesn't- er, not Rick. Gray doesn't need any eggs today. No siree. How much lumber do I have now? Oh, I almost have enough for the uh, kitchen. Vegetable festival will be held on the ninth day of summer. Bring you best. Bring you best. I will bring me best. And now I'm Irish. I'll bring the best potatoes that I can muster. Yeah, the, the weird thing is that the vegetable festival is held on the 9th. You physically cannot have any summer crops grown by then. Like, it's physically impossible. You literally must have brought it in from spring. Or have the kitchen with a refrigerator. Hey, you. Don't bug me. Well, that's new. Let's see. Oh, wait. Today's Wednesday? Anne should be at the farm. Yeah, there she is. Hey, Anne. I have the potato for you. Wow, great, thank you. You've got a face animals would like. Aw, well, thanks, Anne, but you gave me that compliment yesterday. Alright. So today, first thing we're gonna do is hit the flower shop. Because... We've got new seeds in the store. Oh, and Ellie's here. Hi, Ellie. There you go. That's helpful, thanks. Cakes also make good gifts. Most girls like cakes and flowers. That's true. Hey, Basil. Boy, it's hot. Flowers need the rain, too. Dude, it's been summer for one day. Come on. It's so hot every day. No one in the family can take the heat. Poppery just drags around in the summer. It's been summer for one day. But yeah, as you can see, two new types of seeds. Those are tomato seeds. Keep the plants watered and you can get many harvests. One package costs 300G. So they're more expensive than the spring crops, but... When you plant tomatoes, like, you only have to plant them once, and then you just keep getting tomatoes from them. It's really, really nice. So let's see... How many do I want? Do I want eight plants overall? Yeah. And then the other one, those are corn seeds. They take longer to grow, but they sell for more. One pack costs 300 G. I'll get four of each. That gives me just enough left over to have the kitchen, and we'll ship those out to the farm. So both tomatoes and corn grow multiple harvests per season. It's amazing. All right. Is Rick outside? No, he's not. Darn it. All right. One of these potatoes is for the mayor. Hey, mayor. Oh, thank you. I like potatoes. Let me give you a good potato recipe. Try it next time. We get the fried potatoes and bacon recipe. Sign me up for that. That sounds delicious. Yum, yum, yum. 
All right. We're also going to go to the church. Because in the church, the kids uh, have their school lessons here. Hey, May, here's a potato. Wow, thanks! This is my mom's recipe. She wrote it down so I could cook it too when I grew up. I still can't read some parts, though. And we get the potato pancake recipe. Sounds interesting. Is that like a pancake made from potato flour? Or is that like potatoes smooshed together to make kind of a pancake shape? Either one sounds delicious. Hmm, <laughs> so boring. What are you going to do on the farm? Well, today I'm going to plant a lot. Hello, how are you? Oh, I just realized I need to talk to Maria. I don't have any gifts for her, though. I don't have any gifts or gifts for her. Oh, that's right. The library's closed from the 1st to the 10th. Well, Harris is here. Hey, Harris, here's a potato. Thank you very much. Let me teach you the dish my grandma often cooked. It's pretty easy. And we get the garlic potato beef recipe. All these potato recipes sound amazing. Garlic, potato, and beef. Those are three of my favorite ingredients, like, of all time. Okay, let's see. Ugh. I really need to make sure I plant all my stuff immediately. So, let's see. We got six plots. All right. Wrong place. Hello. Who's this? It's Ellie. Hi. The fireworks display is tonight. We can watch it from our garden. If you don't have any plans, drop by our shop. I'll prepare some snacks. Aw, oh, snacks! Oh, that's a tough bargain. Well, I'll come back by again, okay? Oh, Ellie knows the way to a man's heart. I really hope I don't plant too many. Like, watering them's not going to be a problem. What I'm worried about is harvesting days. If the tomatoes and corn need to be harvested on the same day, like, that's my whole day. Hey! Who's this? It's Anne! Say, the fireworks display will start at 7 o'clock tonight. Why don't you come to our ranch? If you're busy and can't come, that's okay. But I'll be waiting. Well, good luck! Yeah, so each of the girls will come at a different time of day and be like, Yeah, fireworks display, I'm gonna be watching here, so you should come by. So you can basically watch the fireworks with the girl of your choice. I'm not sure if you can watch them with a girl who's still at Whiteheart, so I don't think we can watch it with Poppery, but... Alright, I'm not using the empty bottle right now. That was close. For a second there, I thought I planted it in the wrong spot. Tomatoes on the left, corn on the right. Oats, peas, beans, and barley grow. Hi there, who's this? Which lovely lady is wanting to watch fireworks with Jack tonight? <laughs> it's Karen. Hey, how you doing? Did you know tonight is the fireworks display? I'm going to watch from the beach. It's a good place because it's des deserted. Why don't you come? See you. Oh, Karen's has the hots for us now. Alright. Yeah, so, Maria, I can't remember. This is all today's shipment, right? I'm taking it, okay? I think Maria, I want to say she's at the library tonight. I can't exactly remember. Ellie will be at the bakery. Anne will be at the farm. And Karen's at the beach. I think Poppery will be on the Moon Mountain Summit. I'm not sure, though. Alright, I'm going to show off all the different girls uh, today. Like, believe it or not, I actually want to show off what the fireworks festival is like for all the girls I can. So, making a safe state right here. Man, yeah, we didn't even get to explore what was different in the mountains in the summer, but that's okay. So let's start with Karen. I am not going to watch... I'm going to want to watch him with Maria, so... We'll start with Karen. Good evening. You came to watch the fireworks. I'm glad. Really? I thought you hated me. I don't like crowds, but I didn't want to watch alone. 
I agree. I hate I hate large crowds too. It's very intimidating. I haven't watched the fireworks for a long time. I was sulky and I didn't go out. Oh. Look! The fireworks are being reflected in the water. It's so beautiful. I'm glad you came. Thank you. See you later. So that's the fireworks of Karen. Now we're going to do fireworks of Anne. Yeah, I don't think I can watch them with poppery. That's okay. Yep, walk out to the ranch. Hey, Anne! Jack the <laughs> highly eligible is here. What's up? Oh, you came. Wow, text box on the top of the screen. That's unusual. Here, here. It's the best place to watch from. We don't actually get to see them. My dad and brother went into town. Oh, beautiful! Bobbing their heads. Wow, the Karen's gave us a lot more depth than Anne's. Oh, hey, not it's not over. That's the end. But I've got some fireworks. You want to light them? Ooh, look at that. Lighting two of them at once makes a big, pretty show. But it ends sooner. Where did you buy fireworks, Anne? I thought they were outlawed here. Alright. I'm gonna at least check to see if I can watch them with Poppery. Whoa! <laughs> That's a graphical glitch. Yeah, you'll notice there's some different stuff here. Like, there's there are these green things. And no longer- and, like, the uh, oranges now. But no very berries. Alright, Poppery, are you up here? She is! Hey, Artie! Hi! You know, considering you hardly even talk to me, you're kind of excited. This is my favorite place. I like it because it's kind of empty. Oh, that one was pretty. Beautiful, aren't they? It's amazing. It's the same fireworks of every year. But they always take my breath away. Wow, I actually did not think I would be able to uh, watch them with Poppery. I thought she wasn't at a high enough affection. Guess you can watch them with any girl regardless of the affection level. Alright, time for Ellie. Hey, Ellie. Hi. I'm glad you came here. You can see pretty well. Let's go outside and watch together. Oh, here. I baked some cookies. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Cookies. Oh, no, 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 no. Kawabanga. That last part was not good. Oh, and Grandma's being the third wheel. Cool. <laughs> Grandma, aren't you cold? It's summer, Ellie, of course not. I watched this year, too. Ho, ho, ho. When you get older, you don't know if you'll be able to watch them the next year. So you feel very happy when you can.
Come on, Grandma, you're immortal. <laughs> Wait, Artie. I have some sparklers. Why don't we light them together? Ah, Ellie. This is a very romantic date. Sparklers and cookies. Yes! Firework displays are nice, but when I light sparklers, I really feel like it's summer. Oh, That one's pretty adorable. But time for Maria's. I can't remember if Maria's at the library. No. I do not want to change perspective on the farm. Some people like the change perspective, but it doesn't change the perspective on any of her screen. I can't remember if she's in this part of town or if she's at the goddess pond. I want to say she's at this part of town. Her house, maybe? Nope! Uh, apparently it's the goddess pond screen. I forgot. The problem is, if you want to hear all of their, like, I'm gonna watch here, you have to stay at your farm the whole day. Who's got time for that? <laughs> Nobody. Nobody got time for that. Hey, where... Where could Maria be? Oh, I know. I think Maria's at the town square. That's the only other place that even remotely makes sense. That or maybe the church? Mar Maria is the only, like, girl in the game who's, like, religious, so... She could be at the church. She's definitely not at the bar. Oh, yep, sure enough. Fireworks make big bangs, don't they? I want to be the guy who lights the fireworks when I grow up. Flowers in the sky! Cool, isn't it? Yep, I never thought of it like that before. I like eating roasted corn and watching the fireworks display. Well, who wouldn't? Hey, Rick. I think fireworks are profound. I want to learn all about them. Hello, welcome. What'll it be? Oh, uh, you sell the same stuff every time. Hey, you should buy something. They're good. I'm saving for a kitchen, man. I can't cook myself yet. Ugh. That is, without a doubt, the t most terrifying part of the whole game. <laughs> I want to eat cotton candy. I'm really looking forward to this. When is, uh, when is it going to start? When I talk to my girl. Good evening, Artie. I'm glad we can watch the fireworks together. Oh, I could predict what she was saying ahead of time. It's almost like I've played this before. Kyo! What super fireworks! Okay, I swear those- I've met teenage girls that look exactly like those teenage girls. Beautiful, isn't it? If you have the time, how, how about we light some fireworks together? How are these girls getting all these illegal fireworks? Sparklers. Nope, nice period there. <laughs> I have to point out every grammatical mistake in the game. They're kind of sad all on their own, but I like sparklers. Sparklers are cool for the first one or two, and after that it's kind of lame. Today was a good day, and I'm going to have a good sleep. Yeah, I am. Check out that amazing summer song. Uh-uh, not dealing with that. There we go. I will deal with rain. Clouds will gather from tonight through the morning, and it will start to rain. The rain will continue all of tomorrow. That's cool. Alright, we'll probably only get for two days today, because I'm actually showing off, like, everything. Alright. Now we really have to make sure no weeds pop up and destroy our crops. Everybody's a chicken now! Sweet! We get six eggs a day. Oh, I got three eggs. I guess we'll give Gray an egg. There we go. Now it can be hard to maneuver the chicken coop. 
do 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 Honestly, I feel like the seasonal music gets better with every season. So, like, I really like the spring one, don't get me wrong, but I, I do feel like every season the music gets better. Which is ironic, because I used to think it gets worse every season. But my tastes have changed. Hey, horse! I should buy the brush pretty soon, most likely. Can you imagine how long it would take to water all of these crops if we did not have the golden watering can? Even if we just had the silver watering can, it would take forever. And yes, it is important to note that each additional, uh, like, supercharged power for the watering can does take more stamina. So just watering once will take one stamina. I think doing the super one will do, take, like, five stamina, maybe? I can't exactly remember. It's first day, Gray will be in Moon Mountain. Cool. Do 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 do. Hey, Ellie! Here's the egg! Wow, that's helpful, thanks! Cakes also make good gifts. Yes. Ellie, are you subtly trying to tell me to buy a cake? Actually, it's not a terrible idea, but Maria's not even in the library these days, so. Forget that. Hi, Artie. You sure look like your grandpappy. Well, I mean, the jeans are there, so... Yeah, you see this paper here? That's the cabinet order. Not gonna buy it, though. Not yet. Hey, Rick! Me, Artie. <laughs> Wait, this isn't Lego Star Wars? I shouldn't be talking like a pirate. Boop, boom, boop, boom. And yes, the girl who you choose to watch the fireworks with does, in fact, get an affection boost. Hence why I want to watch with Maria. Oh, okay, so that part of the mountain just is, like, partially red in the summer, I guess. Oh, the cicadas are in full force. Hey, Gray. He likes eggs. Because chickens are like the one thing he doesn't have on the farm. Hey, yeah. So, I should probably mention this. So, in the summer, from the 1st to the 10th, when the library's closed, Maria's schedule completely changes. Hello, how are you? What will it be today? We want love. I can't believe we've already had two typhoon warnings. That's kind of hilarious. Yeah, so Maria has a 50% chance of showing up here and a 50% chance of showing up... Uh, I think, I want to say Fisherman Tent Screen. Thank you very much. Oh, what a pretty music. Oh, oops. Yes, what is it? I totally forgot. I was going to give that to her. Ugh. So today, I will order the kitchen, hey dude. One kitchen, please. Shall I make that? Yes. Okay, I'll drop by the farm to make an estimate. Give me the lumber and money, then. Alright, you can always count on me. This is a tropical fruit. Again, you can sell it. Hey, Cliff. When I'm hungry, I hunt. When I need money, I work. Just living day to day. How very wise of you. Eh, yeah, eh. Wow, thank you! I haven't talked with humans for a long time. I forgot your language. Yeah, you've mentioned this. Have you noticed that I happen to have a very expensive rare bottle of wine in my position? No! This is a walnut. Those don't sell for a whole lot, but every little bit helps. There's also a recipe you can permanently miss. It, uh, involving walnuts, so... Get that recipe first summer, because there's a good chance that you can actually permanently miss out on that recipe if you don't get it first summer. Whew! Whew! Another tropical fruit up here. 
Also, nighttime music in the summer does change slightly from spring. As you can tell, we are hearing frogs now! I feel like there's not quite as much stuff to forage in the summer, but... At this point, you don't need to forage as much, because you've probably got chickens and crops. Good, okay, I'll get started tomorrow. Awesome. We cut up enough lumber tonight so that we have enough to get the kitchen, which is amazing. So tropical fruits you cannot use to get recipes. Walnuts, on the other hand, there's one recipe we can get. So I will keep one of those walnuts around for tomorrow. I will not dig up another broken music box because I still have the fixed one. Hey, horse! <laughs> I love how if you constantly are changing direction on the horse, you can ride it without it even making a sound. I think that's funny. Alright, let's level up our axe and then we'll go to bed. Alright, that's all the time we are going to have for today, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Colorful Artie. I hope you tune in for the next episode. Things are going to be going a lot more quickly because I'll be cutting out a lot more footage. Anyhow, have a great day, and as always, God bless.